Jacinda Ardern has become the first New Zealand Prime Minister in 15 years to visit the country's territory of Tokelau in the Pacific. We'll go live now to our New Zealand correspondent Jackson Williams for more. And Jackson, the timing of the visit has stirred up a bit of controversy. Yeah, the National Party here in New Zealand has taken issue with the timing of this trip. Jacinda Ardern will be out of the country for one week. That is just because of how remote Tokelau is. It takes almost 24 hours to travel there by boat. There's no airport in Tokelau. The Prime Minister travelling in a Navy vessel, even sleeping overnight in that vessel for the entire duration of this trip. So it's far from glamorous a uh, trip the Prime Minister's currently on, but one the opposition party here in New Zealand has taken uh, issue with, and that's purely because of the timing of the issue and Simon Bridges, the national leader, saying Jacinda Ardern uh, is ignoring uh, pressing uh, issues here back at home. It's the middle of a three-week sitting block at the moment uh, and uh, we've just uh, had a three-week recess. That's when Simon Bridges uh, says the Prime Minister should have taken that trip. Tokelau is a dependent territory of New Zealand. It's a, a territory with a very small population, but one that the Prime Minister believes shouldn't be ignored. Here's, though, the uh, opposition leader, Simon Bridges, who has taken issue with the Prime Minister. We've just had a three-week recess. We have Parliament on, and she's decided to spend days getting to a place where every member of Parliament in this House has more people on particular streets than live there. Simon Bridges has accused the Prime Minister of ignoring some pressing concerns back home. There's a major land dispute uh, at the moment near uh, Auckland Airport. The protest is now in its eighth day. Thousands of people have gathered at the site over the past week, which is considered sacred to many uh, Māori. And the Prime Minister, Jacinda Ardern, stepped in on Friday after initially saying her government would not be intervening. Government ministers are now involved with discussions trying to uh, seek a resolution to this uh, land dispute. The acting Prime Minister, Kelvin Davis, uh, has defended uh, the Prime Minister's absence. Well, look, the Prime Minister does have her um, uh, obligations. You know, uh, having a, an international visit isn't something that can be just switched on and switched off. There's a lot of preparation that goes towards it, and, and she has to fulfil those obligations. And uh, those of us who are left behind uh, are working on brokering a solution to this. So Simon Bridges, uh, as opposition leaders do, has had a go uh, at the Prime Minister uh, for the timing of this trip. Uh, it's worth pointing out, Kieran and Annalise, the last New Zealand Prime Minister to visit Tokelau was Helen Clark. That trip occurred all the way back uh, in 2004. So many people consider that this current trip by the Prime Minister uh, is long overdue, given residents there uh, in Tokelau are New Zealand residents and they uh, should not be forgotten.